Hi, I'm John Humphreys with the 90 second CSV JDBC tutorial. CSV JDBC lets you treat CSV files as database tables, parsing data from them at will with simple SQL queries. Our example requires just three libraries, the first one being the CSV JDBC library itself, and the other two being for shortening our database query syntax using Spring JDBC templates. We start our Java code by defining a location for our CSV files. Each file is by default treated as a database table. We also define a sample query which returns the full name and age of anyone who is less than 30 in the file. If we look at the people.csv file, we can see that each column that we use in the query is defined in the file header. This is how the table schema is defined. Two people are under 30 in this file, which means we should get two results from our query. Our code creates a basic data source noting the CSV location. It adds one property to override the default behavior of considering all columns be string, since we need to filter on the age column as an integer. It then uses this data source to create a JDBC template which we use to run our concise query and get the results. If we run the program, we see that it just outputs two people as we expected. And that's it! We'll finish up with some useful links you can use to learn more about CSV JDBC, JDBC templates, and code screen. One of the links tells you the rest of the properties you can use to configure this library more, as in the one that we used for the data types. The final link is to a tutorial on CodeScreen.com with full code and text for this tutorial. Thank you for watching, and tune in for more 90-second tutorials to help you get more done faster.